So the other day, War of the Fat Italians 2022 came out, so I decided I wanted to do a review of it, so let's just get right into this. I honestly thought this War of the Fat Italians was pretty entertaining as a whole. I kinda wish it wasn't a War of the Fat Italians because I was interested in the whole court stuff going on, but after like two minutes we just get into challenges, I kinda wish they would've done more with that honestly. Speaking of the challenges, I honestly think the challenges were pretty entertaining. I've noticed some of the challenges were more Mario and SMG4 related, which is fine, honestly. Some challenges consisted of skateboarding, one relating to Bleach, and I think one related to, like, compliments on, like, Twitter posts and stuff. Which is probably arguably one of my favorite challenges to come out of all the challenges. As a whole, that's really everything I could say about the challenges. The challenges were pretty entertaining to watch. Now let's get into the rap battle. Oh boy, the rap battle. That was, um... That was pretty fire. I loved it. It kind of gave me vibes to the YouTube arcs rap. Maybe for the way it sounded. That might just be me, honestly. But honestly, just what a good rap. Probably one of my favorite raps to come out of SMG4. Now, what comes after the rap, honestly, just kind of bugs me. So, you know, the usual happens. After the rap, Lawyer Kong gets defeated like some of the other villains and... I was expecting something interesting to happen, like after he started glowing, I was like expecting like just something like groundbreaking to happen, but no, he's defeated and that's really it. Like at least with like some other villains like Zero, the characters had to work their butt off to defeat him. Like in the Genesis arc, yeah, they defeated him, but he returned in the next arc. But with Lawyer Kong, he's just instantly defeated. That's it. Nothing else. But that's honestly really it. After Lawyer Kong gets defeated, um, Miyamoto comes out of nowhere and the characters like, um, SMG4, SMG3, Bob and Boopkins get redesigns. Now here's my thoughts on the redesigns. SMG4 I think is decent, I don't hate him. SMG3 is just fine, he has a beard for some reason. I think Bob is... fine. He's okay, I guess. Boopkins is probably the worst, he just looks like a watermelon and I don't like it. As a whole, War of the Fat Italians for this year honestly wasn't that bad. I had a few gipes here and there, but as a whole, wasn't that bad. I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. What did you guys think about War of the Fat Italians for this year? Let me know in the comments. Well, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.